Hi, in this video, I will show you how to import SketchUp model to Unreal Engine. Let's get started. The first thing to do is download the Datasmith application. This is the web address to download Datasmith. Select SketchUp Pro Exporter, and then select your Unreal Engine version. To download Datasmith for older Unreal Engine version, click View Achieved Version. After download the installer, install Datasmith application. After installing Datasmith, open a SketchUp model, the Datasmith toolbar will appear, and it is ready to be used for export to Datasmith format. Before export the SketchUp model, change measurement units to centimeters, click Window, and then click Model Info, and go to Units tab. To export SketchUp model, click Export button, and input file name, and folder path of view Datasmith files destination. Before import new Datasmith format file in Unreal Engine, you must enable the Datasmith Importer plugin, go to Edit, select Plugins, and then find Datasmith Importer from Importers list, then check Enable, and then restart Unreal Engine. After restart, Datasmith toolbar will appear. Click Datasmith to start to import new Datasmith file. Select Folder Destination on Project Content Browser, and click OK, then click Import button. To speed up compiling shaders process, open Task Manager, then go to Details, then find Shader Compile Process, right click, and set Priority to High, and click Change Priority button. After import the model, set up, and configure the layout, or position of the model on the level. After importing the file, and then click play, we can see that player can walk through the model without collision, so we must add collision in all models. To add collision, on Project Content Browser, go to Geometries folder, and then select All, then right click, go to Asset Actions, and click Bulk Edit via Property Matrix. In the right side pane, select Static Mesh, then select Body Setup, and then select Collision Complexity. back to level, and click play to start, now we can see, all models have collision to player. After adding the lights, sometimes, some component has abnormal like this, to solve this problem, we must generate UV of the component. Right click the component, click edit, in component editor. Go to Window tab, and click Generate UV, then click Apply. 